Welcome to this tutorial from Visual Basic 2008. Subtitles will be added soon to my tutorials, because... Yes. I am Microsoft and, and my speaking is not really good. Start with opening Visual Basic 2008 and starting a new project and name it as you want. This is the window you see. You can make the form bigger and change a lot of things as you want it. You can find the toolbox at the left side where you can add a lot of things. Start with adding one label and one button. Select the label and at the right side you can find a tab properties where you can find a category name text. Click on label 1 and change the text as you want it. At the top side you can test your project by clicking on the green play button. You can do the same thing with button 1 and form 1. After this all you have to double click on button 1 and we will add our first code or script. This is the place to be. You can add here all of your codes you want. I will type here a code, which will show you a MSG box and the label will change in another text. Alright. Start clicking between the private sub and end sub and type in MSG box open bracket quote ocean mark hello world Quotation mark close the bracket. Press enter and type in label one dot text equally button then a quotation surprise and again a quotation. It is a long code, but you will see, it is very simple. The first line will create a box that pop UPS when you click on button one. That's why you had to click on button one before adding your code. The text between brackets is the text that will be displayed. The second line will change the text from label 1 into surprise. Alright. There done. Great work. I think you are really curious now, aren't you? So, let's click on the green button, and test it out. Have fun. The second tutorial will be added soon, and I hope you enjoyed me, and my tutorials. Oh yeah, one more thing. If you want a label to change immediately after you click the button, then you have to change the order of the two lines. Thank you for listening.